Got up. Finna get off that boat in San Juan. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Let's get out there. I got my, my 80 drinks on Mr. T, Mr. T style. I don't care. Okay, yeah, so we finna get off that ship, man. You know, you gotta wait in the lines right here to go off the ship. Make sure you have your cell and sign card. That's how they identify who get on and off the boat. So yeah, you gotta scan to get off. That way they know you off the ship. And do not lose it, cause it'll be a process to get back on board. Got to walk down a little thing. So now we finna get off the ship. And of course, you know what happened when you get off the ship. Be ready to take that picture. So let me go ahead and take this picture real quick. Then I'm going to show y'all how big the boat is. We didn't have any pre-planned excursions or agendas that we was going to do. We basically freestyling. So we just sitting here off the boat trying to find somebody walk up with some kind of tourist uh, beaches or something so we just sitting here finna figure something out find somewhere to go so yeah the guy told us he'll take us to the beach uh they got one beach he could take us to for ten dollars a person and one for fifteen person and fifteen dollars per person when he says the good beach so i guess that's where we headed to right now so yeah we in the taxi just riding looking at the the land of puerto rico This man literally dropped us off at water and saying, man, they had nothing there to do. So, yeah, this is us walking to the front of the hotel to try to see if we could find a bathroom at least. God, at least. Suppose there's a hotel with a casino somewhere up here. So, we at least can try to find that to try to find some of do. Because, man, this is terrible. Nowhere to sit. And it's off and on rain. Look at the sky, man. This is terrible. So the rest of my family, they ended up headed back to the port area because of the off and on weather. We ended up finding a casino, did a little gambling. And yes, finally did some at the casino. Had to be in Puerto Rico, but I did some. So we up, now it's time to go. And we headed to the port with them and we gonna do some shopping or whatever with them over there. And we getting up out of that casino. Look at that view, look at the boat back there though. So we just walked by a wild chicken. It's crazy. Hey, I hear just cool. So yeah, this over here by the port, this like literally across the street, probably like five minutes max walk. Yeah, they got some shops, some eating places, things right here you could do if you don't want to go out into deep into San Juan. But yeah, it's right across the street, literally. Too many birds, got some hookah. No booze cruise, gotta find the hookah. Booze cruise, cloudy visions. Oh, shit. What the fuck going on out here? Hey, man. Damn. This the fucking zoo? Dang, you ain't gonna kick the fucking dog out? The fuck? Goddamn dogs, chickens, birds. I can't smoke in peace? They trying to take a brother out the game.
Time to head back to that boat, man. You see, they got the guards right there checking people room keys. Make sure they have access big platinum action. But, uh, yeah, you see the Mardi Gras. Look how big that Mardi Gras is, man. It's a big old boat. That mark huge. And this boat had just came not too long ago. And they got that other boat over there. I think one of these boats is a cruise ship that stay overnight, if I'm not mistaken. Look at the cruise girls, man. They welcome us back getting litty. Look at that message on that sign. It says, escape to every day, man. Escape to every day and go ahead and book a cruise. You won't regret it. I promise you, you won't regret it. Escape it. Yep, so nah, man. You see the line right there? It's not that bad, but yeah, it's time to get back on that boat, man. Back to the room. They got the tall animals. We got a elephant today. That's fire right there, man. Looking just like Dumbo. <laughs> We finna sit our stuff down, go up to the Lido deck to the Tiki party. And since we ain't getting no water, we finna go to the Serene deck and get that jacuzzi. Okay, yeah, we finally here at the Serenity Deck. If you're not familiar with the Serenity Deck, that's the area where it's uh, 21 and older only. No kids allowed up here. You see, we got our own jacuzzi up here. A lot of areas to lay at. Oh, if you didn't bring your towel out the room, don't worry. You can just go there, give them your room key. Just get two towels or how many towels you need. You just got to turn them in before the ship over. But yeah, if you see, they got a lot of spacious area out here to lay out, relax, chill, lay in the sun, get away from the kids that will bother you. But look at bro right there. He got him a little, little cool little bit. He ready to get it on and pop and look at him. He finna get active. But yeah, man, they got a bar up here too. So you get your drinks, get your buzz on. They usually have a little salad bar too where you get a little grub, a little healthy eats. Gotta have some on that stomach when you're drinking. Look at everybody just laying out, vibing, full of that drink, man. Getting full of that booze. Booze Cruzello, you know how it go. Get them booze, man. This is what I like about the Mardi Gras. They actually have a, a serenity pool. Most boats don't have the pool. They just have two jacuzzis. But yeah, they actually had a whole swim pool right there. But yeah, let's see how crowded this uh, jacuzzi is. They need to have two more jacuzzis, actually, though, with all that empty space over there. So I guess it's more layout for to lay in the sun. But let me get in this jacuzzi. Oh, wait, let me go see what's on this side real quick. Maybe it's just a 360 round, or maybe it's something else over there. I don't know. I'm not sure. Let's go see real quick. Oh, yeah, it's just 360 round. 
man look at the vibes out here though man that's a nice view man although it was very rainy off and on out there the vibes actually look pretty cool right here and look at look them other boats on the side of us man but yeah it's a nice little view the layout on that boat look kind of litty i don't know if they have a party life over there like corner or not but i don't know look a bit litty though If you ever want to cruise, look for the show Love and Match. This is one of my favorite shows. They get three different couples, have them sitting back to back, and he asks them different questions, see if they answers match up. Uh, he picked three different couples by the longest married, the shortest married, and the middle married have to audition. They have to do this right Double, here. Double three, two, one to the red. Go. Ah! <laughs> Spring, where and when? Work 2003. Work 2003. Okay, listen, this was like 21 years ago. Audience, what are you guys going to do? You want to give it to him or not? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> hey. oh, the majority is smoker. They do not want to give it to you either. Okay, listen, was it 2003 or 2002, Kenny? It was definitely 2002. Don't listen to her. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are harsh. All right, yeah, wrong answer. All right, what and where did you guys first meet? Tell me, John. Uh, dance club in 69. All right, summer of 69, huh? Tony, where was it? Sunny Dance Club, 1969. All right. <laughs>